in this video we want to look at cytokine cytokines are derived from two greek word cyto means cell kine means movement so literal meaning cell movement but in reality cytokines are involving much more complicated process cytokines are come from greek word cyto means cell kines mean movement so literal meaning cell movement but in reality cytokines are involving much more complicated process cytokines can be considered as messenger molecules of our immune system it can considered as messenger molecules of our immune system this cytokine can help in cell to cell interaction like lymphocytes dendritic cell macrophages other inflammatory cell like neutrophils endothelial cells and connective tissue cells so cytokine can help in cell to cell interaction how can we find cytokine cytokines are proteins produced by many cell types that modulate the function of other cell types so how can we find cytokines are protein molecules produced by many cell types that many cells modulate function of other cell types cells involved in cytokine production here we saw many cells involving so what are the cells activated lymphocytes macrophages dendritic cell endothelial cell epithelial cell and connective tissue cells many cells what are the cells activated lymphocytes macrophages dendritic cell endothelial cell epithelial cell connective tissue cells and among others first three activated lymphocytes macrophages and dendritic cells are major source for cytokine production these three cells are major source for cytokine production what are, what are the cells activated lymphocytes macrophages and dendritic cell let's move on site of action majority of cytokine act on the cell that produced them autocrine action or neighboring cells paracrine action autocrine means it produced it same cell that reaction name is called as autocrine action or neighboring cells name is called as paracrine action very rarely they can act on distant site that name is called as endocrine action so three type of action is there within same cell name is called as autocrine neighboring cell name is called as paracrine distant cell site name is called as endocrine action site of action cytokine act and the cell that produced same cell name is called as autocrine neighboring cell paracrine and distant cell. site name is called as endocrine cell then cytokine involved in inflammation what is inflammation it is a complex reaction inflammation is a complex reaction that happen in vascularized tissue and that reaction are responsible for blood vessels and also some vascular events particularly by leukocytes what is inflammation it is a complex reaction that happen in vascularized tissue and that reaction are responsible for blood vessels it may be acute or chronic in nature some cytokine involved acute inflammation some are involving chronic inflammation some are involving both now we see about that example so inflammation it may be acute or chronic in nature some cytokine involving acute inflammation some are involving chronic some are involving both first one is cytokine involved in acute inflammation they include tumor necrosis factor interleukin 1 interleukin 6 interleukin 17 and hemokine so acute inflammation include tumor necrosis factor interleukin 
six, seventeen, and hemokines. Second one is cytokine involved in chronic inflammation. They include interleukin twelve, interleukin seventeen, and gamma interferon. Example of chronic inflammation: interleukin twelve, seventeen, and gamma interferon. We already saw some are involving both. Example: interleukin seventeen involve involving both acute and chronic inflammation. So, cytokine involved in inflammation. What is inflammation? It is a complex reaction that happen in vascularized tissue. That reaction responsible for blood vessels and also some vascular events, particularly by leukocytes. it may be acute or chronic in nature some are involving acute some are involving chronic some are both acute inflammation include tumor necrosis factor interleukin 1 interleukin 6 17 and hemokine then chronic inflammation involving interleukin 12 17 and gamma interferon both some are involving acute and chronic inflammation example interleukin 17 then sources tumor necrosis factor are produced by macrophages mast cell and t lymphocytes interleukin 1 are produced by macrophages endothelial cell and epithelial cell sources tumor necrosis factor are produced by macrophages mast cell t lymphocytes interleukin are produced by macrophages endothelial cell and epithelial cell both tumor necrosis factor and interleukin have same process same function only but interleukin 1 greater role in development of fever next video we will see about different function of tumor necrosis factor and interleukin 1